Hello, and welcome back to a new vlog. Um, today I want to talk a little bit about um, health, uh, especially in Fulika, and I have gotten out a perfect example uh, for this video. This is Atlas, who has been having some kind of mystery illness now since December 2020. Um, he's still not 100% healthy, but he has uh, recovered a little bit. Uh, his main symptoms were uh, deep retraction, no appetite, no activity, um, leth lethargy, um, and unresponsiveness to touch. And um, what worried me in the beginning was that when I went away for holiday, he had not eaten a single thing uh, when I came back. And um, I've been doing my best to diagnose him together with the other uh, admins in the snail group that I am part of as a uh, moderator and I got a lot of good help from them. Uh, we were at a loss at what to do because otherwise he is doing fine, he is healthy. Um, so we have tried a few different methods to, to see if we could help him and Although I will not say what it was, because we are still not sure it is a definitive good medicine or should be used, it was the only option I had left, because he was unresponsive to everything else. Um, and after being treated with this, I think it was two times, and then one extra time later, he suddenly got his appetite back. Um, and I want to point this out, because in the beginning, he also did not have his um, eating reflex which happens when a snail, say you put a little bit of snail mix on their face, they will automatically try and rasp it away with their radula or try and eat it. But Atlas did not do this in any uh, circumstance or in any situation and feeding him uh, became more of a hand feeding scenario just to make sure he ate something. And even then that was um, very difficult. Um, but after the treatment, he finally started showing um, his eating reflex again, which was the first sign that he was doing a little bit better. Um, and later, he started seeking out food on his own. Uh, and he came out of where he usually rests in his plant pot to seek out more hard foods, hard vegetables, um, and even snail mix. So it's been a very long journey, I feel as a owner and Atlas is especially uh, precious to me because he was the first snail I ever owned and um, I got him when he was just a few days old and just a hatchling which I want to note please don't do this please do not get baby snails that are not um, older or sorry that are younger than two months old and smaller than I think it's five centimeters that is the requirement um, don't pay too much attention to how weird he looks when he comes out. It's just something he has started doing as a result of whatever the illness he has is. Um, he comes out eventually, but what I'm trying to say is, um, well, I lost my track a little bit, but my point is he's doing better and I am able to make him eat and he will uh, seek out food on his own. He will interact with his environment much more. Um, he still sleeps a lot and as you see here he has just retracted again but he also comes back out eventually and um, he even comes out when sprayed with water or when just touched. So compared to how badly he was doing he's doing much better so I hope that this is a road he is going to continue on for a while. And if he doesn't, then that will probably become its own video. And it looks like I probably disturbed him in the middle of his poop. I'm very sorry. Can you, if I lift your shell a little bit, you want to come out, please? He, um, he gets stuck sometimes, but he usually sorts himself out and comes uh, flying out of his shell with a little bit of, um, a little bit of speed here. He's almost out. But I just wanted to give you guys an update and um, hopefully give a little bit of information on 
some illnesses that can happen to your snail and that may not be entirely curable. And as snail owners, we just kind of have to live with this. Good morning. He was um, sleeping in the ceiling of his tank and uh, somehow held on, even though he was retracted really deeply. But he's coming out and uh, he's active. He's lost a bit of weight, but I hope he's going to gain it back. So yeah, um, this became a much longer video than I planned, uh, but I hope um, you enjoyed. And if you have any thoughts about this, if you've experienced a similar cluster of uh, symptoms in your snail and have any tips or feedback, I would love to hear it. Um, maybe there is still hope for this troublemaker here, but I am at my wits end and I am comfortably um, moving forward now knowing that he might not be 100% healthy, but he eats, he poops, and he sleeps. And um, that's good enough for me. So um, thank you for watching, and uh, I'll see you guys soon. Say bye!